Hiya. So I need to film this before my phone overheats again because I've filmed this five times and it's overheated every time. I am doing a vlog. I am going to Newcastle tomorrow. I'm super excited. I didn't want to start this at the airport because I just, it would just be a bit confusing. Fly at seven o'clock, I think. I've had my hair done today. It needs a brush because I've I've been playing with it, but I've had my hair done today. So I live about six and a half to seven hour drive away from Newcastle. Um, I could drive, but I'm lazy. I will want to sleep. My friend won't drive my car. So uh, unfortunately we just can't, we can't drive. But to be honest, I'm not mad at it because who wants to drive that far, really? Quite bougie, I know it's literally an hour fly. I've gone to Newcastle a couple times and I've really loved it. I love Newcastle. It's such a good night out if you're looking for a night out um just good vibes it's just good vibes to be honest i've got myself a cafe neuro neuro nero um sandwich it's a salami basil pesto pepper thing so good so good i'm gonna explain more about why i'm going on the day i've been invited to this like event slash birthday party quite a few creators are going um, I'm gonna vlog it I'm gonna vlog me there um, and it's not awkward because they all do the same thing so it's like not awkward at all it's it's like Instagrammers and TikTokers it's kind of a mix of both because I'm a bit of a mix of both really excited um, I've got a really nice outfit I'm taking my friend with me so you're gonna see her and yeah I've got some content to shoot when I get home I'm gonna go get my car clean now because there is bird shit all over my car. That's about it, to be honest. So I will fill you back in with an update. Yeah, essentially I'm just vlogging me going to Newcastle for a few days, it's super exciting. And yeah, I hope you enjoy. I will see you when I'm either packing or whenever I just wanna fill you in on what I'm doing. I will see you then. Just dropped everything. Ugh. One second. Right, let's try this again. So I just wanted to show you where I'm at. Oh, let's ignore the bakers. So this is how my bed's looking right now. This is my case. And in here, I've got a bunch of white tops because I think white tops just go with everything. So I've got a bunch. I've got my dress, sneak peek, bag, jacket, heels, pants. I've got it all. Then I've got over here, all this room to fill up so i've got oh it's a bit dirty so i've got jeans i've got my makeup bag over there but i'm gonna need it tomorrow and basically i'm just stuck at this point this is where i'm at but yeah that's where i'm at at the minute and a bit stressed and like i want to take like sunglasses and cute stuff but it's literally not sunny so it's a bit like mm, why am i doing that this is the airport fit how are we thinking the jacket just makes it life do you know what i mean doesn't this just give you life? This might change. I'm not gonna lie. That this like the bottoms might change, but the tops staying the same. Hello. So last left you when I was slightly packing. Um, I got a bit stressed and didn't video anything else. <laughs> <laughs> she in her um subway. We just had subway. She. I. I don't eat subway, but I get lettuce subway. and onion, and that's it. Yeah vegan oh. we're about to leave to go to her house and then we're going to the airport so i'm gonna next show you at the airport but i just thought i'd pop in and say hi um i've got my jewelry on look at this these are from missouri and these are from plt and primark and look at my nails Ugh. that is it <laughs> i thought you were gonna show mine then <laughs> big i have cute nails to put on but i just haven't put them on yet but my hands look really tan i dyed my eyebrows as well um last night and they look pretty thick I'm kind of obsessed with them what do you think thick bit how are my eyebrows dying um but yes we're flying later on in a few hours i think our flight's at like half seven and then we've got to figure our way to the hotel <laughs> so i will show you when i'm at the airport or on the way to the airport okay hi so i'm at her pretty bedroom look how pretty it is Look how, look at that. Sorry. It's just so cute. In my airport outfit. So, I'll go into this one. So, jacket is from Alfred Keaton. 
Alfred Eden. I got sent it. So cute. I love it. Look at the back. Um, and then I've got the orange top from Zara and legs, leggings, legs, leggings from Zara as well. And then I've just got some Jordans on. And let me show you my necklaces a little bit up close. But yeah, so we're going to leave in a couple hours. And I just wanted to show you my airport outfit. <laughs> I wanted to show you my nails because, sorry, you aren't these the most stunning nails you've ever seen in your life. We got here super early thinking that it would be really busy and that it would be really, really high, like a high security because of COVID. I've not even shown my passport and I'm in the airport. Maybe it's because I'm flying in like, I don't know. I don't know, but the security, like I did get pulled to the side and like my friend did get searched this is her bracelet and my, my earrings so yeah but i'm in starbucks got a pumpkin spiced cookie and i got a cross a cross on is that how you say it and it's oh my god i thought i've lost my watch then it's fine i don't know maybe like half four and our flight's at half seven so I've got a small one, which isn't what I normally get, but I'm gonna have a heart attack if I have a large one. So, Claude at Claude Studio on Instagram, if you want a pair. They're stick ons, they're not acrylics, but they look like acrylics. It's so dead, I'm actually shocked, it's literally dead. And all the restaurants are shut, so like the only place you can eat is from Starbucks. I really wanted to try the pumpkin spice latte, but I was scared I wouldn't like it. And there's also a salted caramel and maple latte, which I really want to try. But I'll keep you updated on what I do. Hiya. So, <laughs> we are an hour down, hour and a half down, hour to go. Um, we had some cat calling. Look at her cute little set. <laughs> Look at her little outfit, how cute. Um, yeah, so I'll keep you updated when I'm on the plane. Um, all these people are going to Portugal. And we're going to Newcastle. And we're going to Newcastle. It shouldn't be long, hopefully. We're on the flight. Okay. Hi. So he's landed. And we're waiting for an Uber. I'm just gonna show you. This is the car park. <laughs> I've just booked an Uber. I'm here. So, here. so I'm in the bathroom. Just checked in. Um, the flight was absolutely fine, to be honest. I mean, did have a few shakes on the way. It was fine. I also want to show you, I've got sent this t shirt. I think it's sick. It's so cool. It just says, I don't actually know what it says on it. It's so cool. But I'm going to show you our room. But yeah, flight was good. Flight was fine. I just got the door. And then here you've got like a mini wardrobe. Already hung my stuff up within five minutes of being here. Um, unlike some people. But I've got my outfit and everything there. I've left two hangers for Annabelle. <laughs> and, then, and then you walk in and I've got my case open and she doesn't take in all of this. There's nothing in yours. Because I'm, I'm sorting oh. it out. Um, and then, so you walk in, there's one double and one single. I wasn't expecting that. So we're sharing double. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, I'm getting double. I was like, no, we're going to share the double because you know that. And then got a little mirror. 
Um, the price of this room, this is so nice. Like, this is nice in the bathroom. Like, the, the, the bath. The room in bath. Yeah. yeah. This is nicer. Like, it's nice. And the view is literally a car park. I'm not going to lie. It's not that vibe. And it's a nice, it's nice, you know, we can sit in bed and watch some TV. Um, and uh, yeah, it's really cute. Mm, uh, mm, absolutely do not. I also got this at the airport, which I'm going to try because the tan that I've been using, um, they didn't sell in under 100 mil. So I bought this and I have a friend who uses this on my her face. And it's meant to be just give you a really natural glow. So I'm thinking I'm just going to spray my whole body with this before we go out. But yeah, that's the room. Hi, so this is the hotel. I just thought I'd show you, because like, I'm outside of it. It's actually huge. And it was super cheap. <gasps> Fuck, okay, I'll tell you about that in a minute. What? Um, but this is the fit for today. This is from Etiquette. Bag of Zara, jeans of Zara, shoes of Jordans. Come on, outfit of the day. This is Molly's, <laughs> this is Zara. <laughs> ASOS. These are ASOS collusion and these are Nike Dunks. But we're on our way to the Metro Centre, the big shopping centre, and um, that's what Nails are clawed. At Claude Studio, I've already added that. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> okay, so I'm in this shopping centre. This is absolutely huge, and I just got a mic cookie dough. Look at that. Oh my god. This is the best thing I've ever eaten. I've never had it before. Look how big. Hi guys. So, I'm in the hotel, we're back. We've got about, oh, I don't know, like five hours till we have to leave. I feel absolutely knackered, I'm not gonna lie. I'll show you our pre-drinks and everything once we're drinking them because if we start now, we're actually gonna pass out and we'll go out. She's over here making some TikTok transitions. Um, even though she's a huge TikToker, you should follow her. Um, how many followers? 300. I'm, I'm absolutely taking the piss about that. I look so mean. But um, she keeps just like going, saying that she's going to go to this TikTok event <gasps> and be like, I'm her plus one. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even said anything about the TikTok event. Oh my gosh, right, let me sit you down. Basically, why we've flown to Newcastle. To be honest, I say it's why we've flown to Newcastle, but like it's just a fun girl weekend away, to be honest. Um, but we're going to a TikTok event, and obviously, I do TikTok. They basically invited a bunch of influencers, Instagrammers, TikTokers, YouTubers, whatever. Um, but Nathan and Grace on TikTok basically, it's her birthday, and she's just planned this huge event party. I spoke to a couple of people. The uh the, the girls who i'm actually friends with on social media through tiktok aren't going which is a bit sad because i don't really know anyone else obviously covid there's not been many events or parties or anything so this is the first one for me um so i'm a bit nervous but i think it'll be fine i've spoke to one girl who's so sweet um we're gonna meet her and there's a couple people in there i'm sure we're gonna get friends with like it's basically like going to a nightclub, to be honest, but they all kind of just know one another from TikTok. Hiya. Okay, so we've started the getting ready process. So the hair is curled. It looks quite nice, actually, as it is. I've not even brushed it yet. Um, I've done my foundation and I've done... Um, that's about it, actually. My skin looks so good on here, my gosh. So we are drinking these, which are like a... BTEC White Claw, hard seltzers. Pretty damn good, to be honest. Um, and yeah, this is the setup. Um, we've seen a couple more people going and we're a little bit more excited now because I literally didn't know who was gonna go, but I've seen people posting and like whatnot. But me and Annabelle don't come to Newcastle, obviously all the time. So, we're going to go all out. We're going to last past 5 a.m. <laughs> but we might do because if it's good enough, we might go to an after party. You should keep watching to find out because you don't know where we're going to end up. Hi, guys. I'm sorry it's so dark, but I'm about to leave to go to the party and I wanted to show you your outfit. So, my dress is from Etiquette. <laughs> Necklace, Primark. Nails, Claude. And shoes are Ego, I think. And what's your outfit? 
this is i have no uh, idea this is i saw it first and my pink oh shit pink heels pink heels are ego ego look at that so i'm just vlogging before we get in the uber um love ya and the next clips that you see are going to be us at the event getting pissed <laughs> ladies <laughs> so sorry for what you've just seen um i've just watched the clips in the bathroom and it was just vile um this is what i look like nails are still on but i got a bit too waved last night i'm not gonna lie when i was throwing up i thought someone had spiked me i was like this i didn't drink this much i was like this isn't normal i was freaking out i was i was literally about to shout to give me one of my pills i was like <laughs> i think so. i've been spiked i was so stressed i was on the body and cranberry and um a bit pissed as for the event grace and nathan lovely so nice some people there But made some friends, which is good. And yeah, it was all right. I'm honestly still a bit pissed, I think, because I can't actually talk. But my gorgeous friend ordered me pizza last night that I didn't eat, but I'm eating it now. Oh shit, look at my fake tan. We need to be out here by 12 and it is quarter to 11. That makes me want to die because I just want to go back to sleep, so. I wonder if I can get late food, checkout. but I don't want leftover pizza. But I look so rough. Oh my god! But it was good. So I hope you enjoy the little clips that I took of it. Um, still in Newcastle till nine thirty. <laughs> Pretty vlog whatever I get up to today. Ugh, I just want to sleep. Do I wake up at half nine? Because that fucking sun was shining in on us. Oh my god! I remember last night just shouting at you, saying, "Open the window." open yeah. the window now and you were like what i was like open the window open the window for what though i thought you were gonna fucking jump so yeah we're just in bed i'm gonna keep you updated because my head's spinning right now so i'll just keep you updated and i'll get up to you sorry but look at this belt. we're in the cutest cafe called um great british cupcakery it's got really cute cupcakes um this is the crunchy caramel shake and i ordered some avo toast to see if that will cure me <laughs> um but it's so cute in here i just thought i'd show you i'm sorry this is my avocado toast um if you're in newcastle recommend this brunch spot i'm not gonna hiya so I've got quite a bit to update you on. What is going on? Well, obviously, earlier I told you we had a long time to wait for our flight. And we came to the shopping centre, me still feeling rough. I did order that avo toast and I didn't eat it. Didn't eat it. But we went to the cinema, which I'll show you in a second, and we watched Free Guy 
to take some time up. That gave us about two hours. We didn't we slept. Yeah, we slept. I literally, we paid to go to the cinema to sleep because I was looking at paying for a hotel room for the night to use for four or five hours to nap. Um, and then Annabelle's boyfriend had a great idea of going to the cinema to nap. So that's what we did. It was a bit loud, a bit of a, not the best nap I've had, but it did the job. I'm a bit more energetic. So now we're at Wagamama's and we've still got about two hours um, to go. I'll show you my food when it gets here. This is what I got. This is a chicken yakisoba and I wanted to show you that was the cinema we went to. But yeah, it's really cute. So I'm just here to finish the video um, because I never actually filmed the process of me going from Wagamama's to the aeroplane. So I'm just coming to fill you in and say goodbye. Um, but I had an amazing time in Newcastle. I have to be honest, I've never been so drunk in my whole life and I don't drink and I was drinking like there was no tomorrow. Um, <laughs> It was just messy, but it was so good. I met so many people. Um, it was good, it was amazing. And I'm really happy I went. It was worth the trip. Um, thank you, Nathan and Grace. It was so much fun. And yeah, so I was feeling absolutely rough. I don't think you were understanding the like how bad I felt the day after, like awful. Like I couldn't eat for like 14 hours since like my last, when I got home, like I literally couldn't eat at all. Like I felt so sick. And my friend was just like eating and like stuff in her face and that's all I wanted to do, but I couldn't. Um, but yeah, it was so much fun. Um, the clips are a bit messy. I'm really sorry that this whole thing is just a bit mismatchy, but I really wanted to vlog it as best as I could. Um, and yeah, nails are still on. We then managed to get to the airport, Newcastle Airport, no offence if you're from Newcastle. It is the worst airport I've ever been to my whole life. It was awful. Like there wasn't even a Boots, a WH Smith, a Costa, Starbucks, anything. There was not even a fast food restaurant. There was a one Burger King that was shut and it was just an empty airport with seats and plugs and you could buy some bottled water and a beer from this like bar, but like, no thanks. So that was fun, but then we got on the plane, landed at half 10 at night, managed to get home at half 12 at night. And yeah, and then I just slept the whole day. Today I'm coming from you Monday. So it's been quite nearly a week since I even left. But yeah, I just wanted to come and say, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you have any questions, leave them down below. Pretty sure I covered like most of my outfits and stuff. So I think it's fine. Before I go, can we just take a second for this outfit? Oh yeah, I'm real. I look like I'm off to a festival, but I'm really not because I'm not a festival gal. I'm doing content right now for this brand. That's why I've got this on. Um, but other than that, I'm literally in my room all day. I've been cleaning and stuff. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching so much. Um, sorry if it's super long. Um, like and subscribe. We'll see you in the next video.